hello you guys and welcome back to my youtube channel my name is stephanie angui in today's video i want to share with you all business ideas you can do with little or no money like little money as 5k as 10k as 15k as 20k as 50k or with zero zero francs but with these business ideas they are very very profitable and you're going to make a lot of money from there so please smash the like button share this video comment down below let me know which of these points you are going to consider and let's see the first business idea you can do with zero zero and resell those fruits you can go to the market you get watermelon you get pineapple you get banana you come and keep them when they are ripe you cut them put them in a tree walk around and sell with this business idea you don't need a lot of money you can also make salad from this um fruit salad and you sell it to people with this business idea you need as little as 5k or 10k to start so if you are looking for something to do with small amount of money in your hand or little money consider starting a food business buy fruits from the market go to where they sell foods very cheaper come back to your neighborhood and resell those food there you are going to make bowls for i think 100 100 francs where you can slice your fruits and put them inside you need maybe a bucket or you need a tray or you need a knife and the fruits themselves so with 10k you can do this business idea is to sell snacks i cannot emphasize enough on this you know whenever schools resume children will go to dormitory they always need people to make them ching ching peanut donut let them carry it back to school so you can start making ching ching today peanut chips today plantain chips today and sell these things you are going to make a lot of money for example when people come to offices they want to be entertained like if you look up here i used to have um ching ching there i used to have ching ching i used to have um peanut up there i used to have um plantain chips and i used to have coconut sweet and granite sweet whenever i have people here i always entertain them but for a while now the person that was selling to me i'm no longer seeing the person again so and i don't have time to go and get another person so if you are thinking of a business idea to do i think flour is so cheap though now flour is expensive right now in cameroon a kilo of flour now is 600 francs it was first of all 350 francs for a kilo of flour but now a kilo of flour 250 francs has added on it now a kilo of flour costs 600 francs so you can buy a kilo of flour you need um, um yeast or baking powder you need butter just need oil for frying with this business idea 10,000 francs you will start the business with it and you will make a lot of money if it is coconut sweet you just need the coconut and you need sugar fine if it's granite sweet, you just need a granite you need a sugar fine so this is a very good business idea if you have very small money or little money and you want to start a business start this business idea today and make yourself supply the snacks to people who sell in the market who will buy from you and then resell them or in a pack people will buy from you and resell you can make money from them or you can supply it to schools for for the go and see a head teacher in a school and you supply it in a school the students will buy a business idea you can do with this one you need just your phone is to buy items online for people and then pick the items and then deliver it to their homes or to wherever they live and you'll make a lot of money with this business idea all you need is just your transportation yes for example i used to buy things from kiku I used to buy things from Kiku and I need to go and pick the item from Kiku. That's in Douala. I need to go and pick the item from Kiku. That's in Douala. I don't have the time. So what I do is that I will tell them to pay. To pay I will send them money. They will pay somebody to carry that item and bring it to me. You understand? So you can be so if, do a pick up service whereby you apply to places whereby people ship items. When those items come, you pick it from there and then you deliver it to the owners and make a lot of money with this business idea i can tell you your delivery days that you deliver every wednesday or fridays people will know when their things come they want to keep it that day because you want a lot of items so that you can carry it at once and also make gain from it it's very important you can also buy items for people online there are online um website whereby people don't have time to go there like she in that kiku even um whatever like Cameroonians, they don't have most Cameroonians don't have master cards to buy online. So you can have a master card. You use your master card, buy for people online, supply it to them in their houses, add a little bit of interest on it. That is money you're making. The idea you can do with no money is to start a teaching program. You can teach people how to do ching ching. You make money. 
teach people how to make fish roll you make money teach people how to make for puff you make money in as much as we say everything is online but people don't have time to put data like cameroonians they don't have time to put data in their phones you can go to churches let me tell you how to sell yourself with this business idea you can go to churches you tell them that anybody that is interested in learning how to make ching ching you are going to teach the person and the person will pay you just some more money now like our women's group in church let's say we say today's um monday we have um women's meeting in our church we say okay today monday i'll come and teach the women of your church on monday how to make ching ching and the women of your church while they are 20 they are 30 or they are 40 i just wanted to pay me ten thousand pounds and then i'll teach them you make money you tell them okay i want to come and teach you how to make cake you make money you tell people okay i want to teach you how to do makeup you will make money in as much as there are, these services are online but people don't have time i for one I learn how to do makeup every single day, but yet I don't know how to do makeup. Like, see my makeup. I learn how to do makeup every single day, but I don't know how to do makeup. So you can, you can tell people that you know how to do their makeup. Normally, there are places whereby they pay two hundred and fifty thousand just to learn how to do professional makeup. But you tell somebody that they, you will give me just two thousand francs, and I will teach you how to do makeup. Let me tell you, if you have a client like me and i have a friend i have a friend who know a friend who know a friend before you know it you will have to make a lot of money rather than thinking that okay because as some people that whenever they see those adverts like if you want to learn how to do makeup 250 they will not apply because you know they just want to learn how to do their own makeup you understand like their own makeup they don't want to learn makeup and maybe open a makeup place they just want to know personal makeup because they they work they are working moms so you teach them Maybe through a Zoom class, you can have like five customers that pay you two thousand francs. You activate data for one thousand two gigabyte. You set up your phone. What happens? You make money. So you teach people how to do makeup. You can know how to teach people how to dance. If you are a dancer, you can teach other cool groups of people how to dance, and they will pay you. If you are a cook, you can teach people how to cook. They will pay you. If you are, you can teach people how to do dieting to lose weight. Like look at me, see how I'm fat. You can teach people how to do dieting and lose. Weight. You can. Have other small girls around your quarter and teach them how to do hairdressing. If you are a tailor, you can teach people how to do tailoring around your environment. You can go to households and teach them how to cook good food and you pay them. You can go to groups in church and you teach women how to cook the kind of food you know they don't have it. Like, see, let me tell you something. Jello rice is very simple, right? You think it's simple until you cook jello rice. There are people that like to eat jello rice, but they don't know how to cook it. So you can go to a, an occasion and you cook for that occasion and after the occasion you say if you are here and you like the quality of our jollof rice and you want to know how to cook this jollof rice in your house i can come and teach you one on one take my number i'm telling you after the occasion if people enjoy the rice they will call you if you see that there's a birthday party somewhere and you have the information go and tell them that you make them jollof rice they'll pay they'll buy everything you just cook for them and they'll pay you small fees you will make a lot of money with this business idea everything these days is monetized everything these days is making money so you don't need to have any talent and then you stay with that talent you have to sell your idea that you can do that can fetch you a lot of income is be a videographer or a video editor i cannot emphasize how many times i have announced that i need a video editor i need somebody to do me videos like you feel my videos and edit them for me and i will pay you I cannot emphasize how many times I have done this on this a lot. Ask a lot of people. This is not the only channel I have. You guys don't even know. Like, you don't even know this is not the only channel I have. I have another YouTube channel. So I've asked people around me, can you do videography? Can you do video editing? And they're asking me to teach them that they don't know how to even do it. You understand? So you can learn how to do videography and video editing and apply these days. There are so many upcoming Cameroon YouTubers. You can take their videos edit it for them and they pay you as little as small money if you're editing for five different people that's much money if you're editing for 10 different people that's much money you just have to have the strength to do the edit. business idea you can do this one is everywhere on on social media is become a social media manager where you manage people's platform there are so many celebrities they don't they, they are not the one that manage a platform they only take their videos edit the videos and upload it on the platforms they need people that can reply to their comments imagine big youtubers that have like 1000 comments 500 comments they don't even have the time to reply to those comments because maybe they're busy they need people that can reply to those comments schedule their videos community posts reply their emails and all that so 
becoming a social media manager is another business you have to consider if you have this idea you can consider doing is rent out your car like if you have a car and you're not using that car all the time put it on hire the days you're not using it somebody can just call you and like i saw your advert that you have a car for hire is the car available all you need is just to wash the car give the person the car keys hiring a car around my environment i know depending on the quality of car but if the car is cheap it's fifteen thousand francs you can hire your car for fifteen thousand francs for one hour for two hours and then somebody will just hire that car go to wherever they are going to come back and pay you if it's for two days that's thirty thousand francs they'll put their foil by themselves it's depending on the car there are cars they hire you for fifty thousand francs you can hire a car for a wedding you can hire a car for a birthday party you can hire a car even as an ambulance for people to use it to remove their cups from the mortuary and they pay you much money so this is another business idea you can consider another business idea you can consider doing is rent out one single room of your house if you have like three rooms and you're using just two rooms, it's a spare room that maybe has a toilet inside and a kitchen you can turn it to a airbnb and you rent it out there are people that cannot rent a hotel because it's expensive but if you have a single room you can rent it out but you have to be careful somebody should not come and quarrel in your house and then police will come and carry <laughs> police will come and carry they'll go and lock you because somebody will come and quarrel in your house you are not licensed they don't know you don't go and lock you <laughs> so with this business idea in as much as you want to make money you have to be careful okay another business idea you can do is to rent out your equipment if you have a camera you can rent out your camera for people they go and use the camera for events and then they pay you you can become a videographer for a wedding they pay you you can use your camera to take pictures for people become a photographer they will pay you you can rent out um your flask if you have flask in your house maybe you just got married you're a new bride your family members they bought you a lot of flask you can rent out those flasks if there's a birthday party a wedding ceremony or a funeral and they need flask to put their food inside they'll come to you you can rent out those flasks you can rent out chairs if you have chairs in your house that you're not using those chairs you can rent out your washing machine to people you can have a washing machine announced around your neighborhood people will come and wash their dresses and they will pay you you can books if you're a student you can rent out your textbook to people they'll use those textbooks and they'll read them and then they'll pay you you can rent out your pots for funerals and people will still use those pots and they'll cook with it and much more whatever you have in your house you're not using you can even rent out your dresses you just have to be careful that the people you're renting your dresses are not sick. You can rent out your wigs. The first idea you can do with little or very small money is to start a small provision store around your neighborhood. Start a small provision store where you sell maggi, you sell salt, you sell pepper, you sell tomato, you sell uh, milk, you sell overtime, you sell bread. You can start a small provision store around your neighborhood or a small table market around your neighborhood. With this business idea, you need just small money to start. Another business idea you can consider doing without money is to buy food items for people from Africa and ship them to other continents like Asia, Europe, America, and all that. There are so many people abroad that want simple items like bush mango, bush pepper, dry pepper. You know, these people want these different foodstuffs. So if you are somebody that you don't have money, all you do is that you tell them they sent you their money. They need even dry fish from Cameroon, dry crayfish, and all that. So you can send them your money. They buy those things from you buy those things from Cameroon and you ship them to them abroad. You can use DHL or any other shipping company that you know. You can use it to ship those items to them. I remember there was a time one person that watched my video on YouTube bought a green tea for me, one carton of green tea. And I was supposed to send that green tea to her in Nigeria. You guys, that green tea took about two to three months to get to her in Nigeria because I didn't have any shipping company. I didn't even know where DHL was. And by then I was heavily pregnant. All of a sudden i put i gave birth so i could not help her doing that paper because i was heavy you can go around do research and work with any shipping company this is a profitable business idea you can do is if you have a laundry machine you can start a laundry service pressing where people come and wash their dresses iron them and then you pay you, you, they, you they pay you for the service like people come and wash their dresses there you pay them that's money you just have a washing machine you're using it to wash all your dresses why not turn it out to a business where people come and wash their dresses there and then you pay, you do electricity is so expensive in Cameroon that you just try it because you want to make money. You can customize it, like put a lot of dresses in the machine, wash them according to the quantity the machine can carry. If it's 7 kg, you not just want to wash one client dress. You can add other dresses together and wash them. Make sure you know how to iron 
very very well with this little idea you are going to make yourself much money so thank you guys so much for watching this video if you enjoyed this video please do give me a thumbs up share this video with your friends and family and until now i will see you all in my next video which of this video ideas you consider doing in 2022